Welcome to 791. It's Sunday at about 12.30 p.m., I would venture guess, and it's somewhat sunny. I'm amazed. Check it out. A little couple of wispy clouds up there, but not bad. Not bad. It's like uh, mid-30s. It actually feels fairly warm out here in the sun. The driveway is dry. The, everything else is, is melting. Gannon and company are on their way. We're going to go up to um, the Beachwood Mall for something to do today. So. So that should be intriguing. We'll film some of that and probably won't get into too many shenanigans, but you'll see. And look at the Honda driver that lives here. She backs back here about two feet off the driveway into the yard, which is of course covered in snow. But my God, learn where your car is. Now to be fair, those tire tracks are clearly Michelin Pilot Sports. But also to be fair, I stopped here, which is, as we can see, on the driveway. All right, guys, Kenan's doing some shopping in there. He'll tell you he's just getting them, but in actuality, he's on a shopping spree. <laughs> I had fun. Remember, Taylor was coming here at about 72 miles an hour. Is that on camera now? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah. I'll stop talking. <laughs> Take it. Oh, is there any such thing as private anymore? Nope. He has Wi-Fi. Who was laughing and saying, if I fell, there'd be like, on top of the there'd be how many iPhones would be, like, all like iPhones around? I still think there should be a stop there. I can't see it. It's weird. 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 We got this guy backing up here. I'd rear end him. Your hair is stuck to it. I don't know. This looks like mail. Mercedes driver probably. Those scrubbers. Mail. Panamera. Yeah, it looks like two nine. It looks like they've gone Porsches today. What two nine elevens and a? It's more than it's worth. That's not much. That. Eleven. Boxster. I don't. That's the new nine eleven. Boxster. Same thing. No. Yeah, five. Can I get it? 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 Can I get Mall cop. There we go. Oh, God. It's a BMW 3 Series. Check this out. G Dogs. Oh, yes. Well, that's classy. I like that kind. What do you think, buddy? I like that kind. Of. That would be the 27 inch. So we have a 27 inch 300 SL. And there's our 740 Sport. Dicks. Does this look familiar, guys? It's better in the summer, though. Damn, mall cops. The worst, Jerry. The worst. We found a bigger smart car over here. Check this out. It's got even. Uh, it's even got the laser jammers in the front. I can respect that. 6.3, 6.2. It's the same shit. C City Three. AMG. Welcome back home. It's uh, something five o'clock. Maybe it's getting dark after five. I have no idea. I've been doing stuff in my office for the last few minutes since I got home. Check this out. We got batteries on the charger. Every time I would get the Mac over here and plug it into this display, which by the way is a 22 or 23 inch. It's 1080p. And it, the the Retina MacBook Pro, you know, I keep it in the scaled resolution of 1920 by 1200. And then I come to the 1080p monitor and it just looks huge. It looks like I'm looking at a 1024 by 768 display from God knows who, how many years ago. Um, so I don't know how much more I'm going to be using that. I, I was in the Apple store today, as you saw, and I looked at the, uh, the iMacs, which aren't retina displays yet. They're still the, you know, the, the 21 and a half inches, 1080p. That's a phenomenal resolution. But by modern standards, when you get used to three retina devices, the iPhone, the uh, iPad, and the, the MacBook Pro now, um, they just look low resolution and you get up to it and you can see lines of pixels and it just isn't clear so it's been a week since I've had the thing and I'm already spoiled and then the 27 inch is 1440p 2560 by uh, 
by 1440, and it has the same appearance to it. Anyways, usually Friday is my gas fill-up day, and I neglected to do that both Friday and Saturday, because I didn't even get the car out yesterday until Saturday late in the day. Um, so I'm going to go put gas in it now. It's not really low, but I, I like to keep my Friday-ish end of the week weekend schedule. I'm going to do that. It was a little warmer today. Snow's melting. You saw this this morning. It now looks like this. It's, it's a lot less to find, and I hope the snow gets out of here soon. If you can see across the street over there, those houses face south. Ours obviously faces north. Our front yard is 75 to 80 percent covered, and theirs is, it's not green, but there isn't nearly as much snow. Well, consider that done. I think that was uh, 9.6 gallons. Not bad, full, got my little thing reset, so now we're good for another week. Okay, home from that, time to play catch up. I don't know what you call it. You know when you live in your life, doing your stuff, you know, and it gets to the point where your wallet is full of receipts, you got stuff all over your desk, and it's all these little impeding jobs that are pending that are so frivolous and, and wasteful, but you, you need to do them with it. It's like things get backed up. It's like defragmenting. So I'm going to do that. I've got probably 20 receipts in my wallet. Look at this. I got receipts. Well, actually, I kind of organized them a little bit, but they're sticking out all over the place, and that needs to be dealt with. Mostly gas receipts, like today at lunch, California Pizza Kitchen. Actually, I don't have that one, but from other stuff, I need to do that. And then the Watch Later playlist is backed up a few days, so I'm going to take care of that. And it's 6.25, so within the next six hours, I should be able to get lots of stuff done, which will be excellent, and uh, get ready for this week, because this week's going to be busy. I, I got stuff coming in, I got stuff going out, I got stuff being installed, I got videos coming up, uh, so I'm looking forward to it. Plus, it's supposed to be decent, not 15 degrees and snowy anymore, because it is February 10th, the 10th of February, so we're um, more than a third done with this month, and that is really good news, because March is usually decent, April starts to get better, and then once we're in May and June, man, that, that's my time of year. So, hey, I'll do what it takes to get there, and uh, we're doing well. I know this year's been pretty slow so far and terrible for the vlogs. I wake up, I go do classes, I come home, I talk to Colt for three hours on the phone, I do YouTube, and I do emails. Does that sound familiar? YouTube and emails? How many times do my lips move and make that, make those words? But, but it's going to get better. When the weather gets better. <laughs> I know I say that, but trust me, there's a lot of cool stuff going on this year, and uh, I can't wait to film it, and I can't wait to do it, and it's going to be awesome. So keep watching. I receipts are done. Now it goes into this drawer in my desk, which is the catch-all drawer for when there's shit on my desk I don't want to put away. I brush it in here. Look at this. This is the old flip. I was actually looking at the footage off of this. It works if I put two double A's in it, and then run a, what is that, HDMI B over to the a TV or a monitor and I can see the footage that was on it from fall 2011. This is the day when this camera died. As you can see it's missing its little flip USB dongle. The USB cable got dicked and it wouldn't do anything. I actually still have part of the cable. That's where it goes on the motherboard. Uh, but that was a day Taylor and I went out and did a bunch of walks. Um, the Metro Park hikes around here in the fall. Then we had dinner or lunch some food at Fisher's and Peninsula and that was a really cool day and that footage has never seen the bandwidth of the internet because it got lost. What's so on there maybe someday in like 10 years on day 4,000 we'll go in there and figure out how to get it off. I got an iPad in here that probably needs to be charged. This thing does a lot of sitting. It's on 12%. I'll have to charge it up tonight get that ready for the work week. We got something from Colt here. Bavarian Autosport, freaking rights. We got Popular Mechanics and we got Automobile with the new Corvette C7 on the back. Those are CDs that have been used in the M5 in its lifetime. I need to organize those. I've got uh, star, what are these things called? Lifesavers, and you know what that is, and you might know what that is for Retina MacBook Pro, and we got some hot chocolate here from last Christmas that I've neglected to use for some reason. A CD that Lindsay was supposed to take back to a teacher that I had like junior year and never gave back, and she's scared to do it, so that sits. Bose headphones, blueprints to the house, an old camera, door opener, and a stylus. Remember those? Well, good morning. It's 2.02 on uh, Monday. Happy Monday. Um, you saw it today. I don't think I need to wrap everything up. It was a pretty good day. It was busy. We got a lot of stuff done. My defragmenting process is done. For the day, everything's organized and clean and ready to go for tomorrow. So I'm going to take the Mac upstairs, edit this together. It's going to be a long one, as you know. Um, hope that is okay. And I'll talk to you guys tomorrow on Monday. We'll kick off the work week. It should be a pretty decent decent one. Good night, and thanks for watching.